Today I'm going to talk about communication methods and systems in the uniformed services. Types of radio comms. Uh, cellular, the use of wireless communication networks to transmit voice and data between mobile devices and base stations. Two way, a radio system that allows two or more parties to communicate with each other. Point to point, a direct communication link between two devices or locations. Wi-Fi, a wireless networking technology that uses radio waves to provide high speed internet and network connections. Different types of radios. There's Pi. Pi is a two-way radio created by George Pi in 1896. This type of radio was widely used in the British military and emergency services during the World War II. Personal role radio, the PR, is a military communication system used by the infantry soldiers to, ma to maintain communication on the battlefield. It is a lightweight single channel, short range radio system that allows soldiers to communicate with each other, their commanders and supporting units. Frequency. Frequency, high, very high and ultra high. Radio communication is crucial in various industries and different frequency bands are used depending on the communication range required. High frequency radios are ideal for long range communication. Very high frequency radios are suitable for line of sight communication up to around 100 miles and ultra high frequency radios are used for line of sight communication up to around 30 miles. The choice of frequency band depends on the communication requirements and the environment in which it is being used. Bowman. Bowman is a digital communication system used by the British Army to provide secure and reliable voice and data communication between troops, vehicles and headquarters. It is designed to be able to operate in challenging environments as well. Different radio communications. Code words. A word or phrase used in place of a particular word or phrase to avoid confusion or misinterpretation. Misinterpretation. Call sign, a unique identifier assigned to a radio operator or station. Phonetic alphabet, a standardised system of using words to represent letters of the alphabet to facilitate clear communication over the radio. Test calls, a brief exchange of information to confirm that the radio equipment is functioning correctly. Standard voice procedures, a set of guidelines used to ensure clear and concise communication over the radio. And lastly, authentication grids, a system used to confirm the identity of the person or unit transmitting a message. Radio procedures for the police. The radio procedures for the police service includes the use of clear and concise language, the use of call signs to identify individuals and units, the use of the phonetic alphabet to ensure accurate communication, the use of authentication grids to confirm the identity of the person or unit transmitting the message, and the use of standard voice procedures to ensure effective communication. Advantages of radio communication allows communication over long distances without the need for physical infrastructure. It can be used in areas where other communication methods are not available. It allows for rapid communication and response times. It provides a secure means of commun communication when properly encrypted. Disadvantages of radio communication their limited bandwidth width can lead to delays or dropped messages. Radio signals can be in 
intercepted and listened to by unauthorised parties. Radio equipment can be expensive and require specialised training to operate and radio signals can be affected by weather and other environmental factors.